here me abane and welcome back to my youtube channel so today we are going to learn how to take more dynamic shots with your phone so let's start with the basic if you don't know what is dynamic range dynamic range is a feature in uh, most of the dslr you might know that name by raw pictures so what is exactly dynamic range increase in dynamic range of camera results to a flat pictures like this this picture looks so flat there are no colors in it there is no contrast in the picture it is because it has more dynamic range this picture is looking flat because uh, the highlights are pulled down so you can see the detail in the sky and the shadows are pulled up so you can also see the details uh, which uh, goes into the shadows so this is what exactly increase in dynamic range means because when you increase the dynamic range or when you click your pictures in raw camera automatically decreases the highlights and increases the shadow that's why it looks so flat and there are no colors in it so of course you are here to learn how to increase your dynamic range while clicking the photos in your mobile phone right no 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 it's not an app it's not a feature of a particular camera it is just a simple trick of focusing your camera at a particular part of the frame this will result in taking all of the details of your photos this simple trick is always focus on highlights yeah that's it okay see you in the next video ha no just joking i'm going to explain why you should focus on highlights what is the difference between this focusing on the highlights and focusing in shadows okay now you can see two pictures one photo is taken while focusing on the highlights and the other photo is taken while focusing on the shadows of course this photos look shit both of these photos look are looking so weird and there is no detail in it if you are focusing on the highlights the blacks are the shadows are totally gone if you are focusing on the shadows the highlights are totally gone so let's take that photo into lightroom where we focused on the blacks and this is what we get of course there is no change right but now let's take the photo where we focused on the highlights and increase the shadows and just blacks and see this result the post production have gone to another level in lightroom it's when you focus on the highlights and take that photos into lightroom and increases the shadows and the blacks you can take out those details out of the dark parts of the photos but if you are going to focus on the shadows and if you are going to take the photos into lightroom and if you are going to uh, decrease the highlights it is not going to affect anywhere to the photo because the details from the highlights are totally gone and you can't get the details back but when you focus on the highlights you still are going to get so much of detail out of this black areas as i told you before this trick is most of the time used for landscape photos and as i told you in the starting of this video we are decreasing the highlights but increasing the shadows in the post production so that is basically means increasing in dynamic range right so yeah that was the video for today guys if hope you have got something new out of this subscribe to this youtube channel and don't forget to make that like button blue and see you in the next video sayonara लास्ट वीडियो में सायन आ रहा बोलना भूल गया था